everybody. This is Randy Santel, Atlas, and I am very, very excited tonight. I'm going for overall win number 1003, and I'm here for the first time in Burns, Tennessee, part of Dixon County in Tennessee, about like 45 minutes or an hour outside of Nashville. We've got lots of people here, which is much appreciated. <laughs> on an old baseball field, but I am outside here with Ott's Barbecue, the owners, Wesley and Victoria. Ott's, thank you to them for having us in. Wesley was a Marine, or I guess once a Marine, always a Marine. Yes, yeah, Semper Fi. Really <laughs> but yes, this is called the Crucible Barbecue Challenge. I am the first person to attempt it, and thankfully I didn't have to do the crucible as a Marine. So thanks to Wesley and everybody in the military for all of your services, but I have one hour to finish everything here. Ott's Barbecue started in September of 2020, and they are doing awesome. It is great to get here to promote them. Wesley has been watching our videos for like four years, so that is awesome. But I have one hour to finish so much of Ott's Barbecue. I think I'm going to start with this full rack of baby back pork ribs. Those look amazing. I was watching them cut them up right off the bone. Along with that, I've got half pound portions of, we've got their sausage, we've got their chicken breast, and then we've got their beef brisket. So that's all gonna be yummy. I do have five sides, six ounce portions. We've got their homemade baked beans. We've got green beans. We've got their loaded baked potato salad. We've got coleslaw, which is also on both of these sandwiches. I've heard great things about their macaroni and cheese. So we've got all this, and then we've got two sandwiches. We've got the loaded and the mess. So Wesley, what is all on the loaded? Seven ounces of pulled pork, cheese, slaw, baked beans, pickles, and our thick barbecue sauce. Yeah, each of these sandwiches is about a pound. I had for the first time barbecue bologna yesterday. Loved it, I get to have some more today. What is all on this? A slice of bologna, about three eighths inch thick, pickles, cheese, four ounces of barbecue, two ounces of slaw, and our thick barbecue sauce. Lots of coleslaw here, lots of food in general. It's all about six and a half pounds total. One hour to finish, if I fail, it's gonna be $90. But if I win, I'll get my entire barbecue meal for free, my crucible challenge meal for free. I will get probably what's gonna be known as the sweetest t-shirt I've ever gotten because they were limited on what they could get. It's freaking awesome, so I do wanna win this. And I'll have my name and photo. I'll be the first person on their wall of fame. Let's get this challenge started. All right, that was a long introduction, so let's just shut up and eat. Big thank you to the owners, Wesley and Victoria. One hour, I think I'm gonna start with the ribs, so let's just do it. One, two, three. Boom. Boom. <laughs> he knew it was coming. They do have four sauces. As you can see here, these are available. You can buy them from here at Ott's Barbecue, but Let's have some of this thick sauce with the ribs. Really doesn't need sauce. said there's 12 ribs per wrap. Gotta make this look easy so people feel comfortable trying it. Bring your 90 bucks, this is a lot of food.
right at seven minutes in, last of the ribs. Let's finish off these beans, and then we're gonna put the bones in the bowl. All right, gonna put this on the ground. Ooh, let's knock out some sausage next. Okay, that is good. I love me some sausage. I wish all the meat went down like this. The sausage was as good as I expected. That is yummy. All right, we still got some vinegar sauce, but we are gonna have, well, first of all, we're gonna try some of the brisket by itself, which I've cheated. I already did that earlier. But uh, we'll also have it with some white sauce. All right. I'm glad I don't have to eat a pound of this. Ooh. White sauce is good. White sauce is made by Wesley, it is good. All right, I think once we're done with this brisket, it's all downhill. take two bigger bites with this brisket. Now we're done. We're gonna give myself a little digestion break and while that uh, brisket is going down, we'll finish off the green beans. That's got some good flavor to it. Little spice to these. Apparently they're cooked down in the brisket trimmings. Very good. I don't know what that does to the calories, but we'll still call them healthy green beans. Better than fries. All right, let's do the chicken. Let's get the meats out of the way. Way more tender than expected. This is awesome. This chicken really is almost as tender as that sausage was. It's going down. Oh, chicken done, and then I think we'll do the sandwiches. Oh, thank you guys for your patience. I'm getting old. All right, try it in this vinegar sauce. All right, I'm done with the meats that were all in front. Now I'm gonna work on the mess. It's got the barbecue bologna that I was in love with yesterday. Uh, this is a big sandwich. Each of these is pretty much a pound, but we'll do this one and then we'll do the loaded. This sandwich has pulled pork in addition to the bologna, but uh, it's still very good. This sandwich is good. I'm glad I started with it so I can get it down while it's still pretty warm. Oh, 
I'm gonna finish that bite and then do a side. Let some of this food move down. Last bite of the mess. Yes. Quick little knee and digestion break and then we'll be all good. Oh, we are right at 35 minutes in, 25 minutes to go. Oh, took a short break. Now we're gonna get back to eating. Let's do the mac and cheese and then we'll do the sandwich and then do these. Let's get some calcium. Done with mac and cheese. All right, this one's got the baked beans on it, so I think that's gonna help it all go down. We'll find out. I'm enjoying these pickles, too. I wish I was playing around. <laughs> Before this started, I said if I'm doing well, I'll get some banana pudding. I think we might bring some out just to show off. Ah. We are done. Ah, 50 minutes and 18 seconds. We've got less than 10 minutes to go, but oh, it is called the Crucible. It's not supposed to be easy. The winning shirt does have my name on it, so. I do kind of need to win. Oh, I don't want to know what, how many calories in this, but. These last 10 minutes is always as rough because any wrong move, I could get sick. So I'm just trying to gracefully finesse all this food down so we can get the win. Thanks for sticking with me. Ah, uh, 53, 55, we gotta shut up and get this done, not only before time runs out, but before we run out of life. I have had a lot of fun, but uh, I'm ready to be done. Ah! Oh, I wanted to finish the time. I don't think I can do it within the short amount of time left, but 58 minutes and 39 seconds. That is the first time to win, so it's the record to beat for the Crucible Barbecue Challenge here. I've heard a lot of things about the banana pudding here, and I myself love banana pudding. We are gonna finish this, and then we'll do the outro. Let's test this stuff out. It is homemade by Victoria, one of the owners, so. Oh, and plus, this is only like two bites, so. Oh, ah, three bites, not just two. That is so good. I got my healthy vegetables with the coleslaw and the green beans. Now I'm getting my healthy fruits in this banana pudding. Mm. <laughs> 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 ah, finger licking good and 
I do know that I'm going to regret that later, but we did it anyway. It's our only time in Burns, Tennessee. Ah, oh, living my best life. I do love banana pudding and that was great. But thankfully, I am going to get my $90 meal for free. I've got to say my favorite part of that challenge, I really enjoyed the ribs, really enjoyed the sausage. I'm gonna go with, is it the mess with the bologna on it? That was really good. If I had especially started at the beginning with it, it definitely would have been my favorite. But yeah, just enjoyed everything, all of those sides, the entire meal. This t-shirt is sweet, so let's show it off. If you finish this challenge yourself, I think you're just gonna get a regular t-shirt, but it is a 3X, so I will be able to wear it uh, until my diet starts. But we've got Ops Barbecue, established September 2020, and then I even have my name on it. So yeah, this probably is my sweetest t-shirt uh, that's gonna go into my collection. Might not even make the collection, I think I'm gonna wear it. So I'll also have my name and photo up on the Wall of Fame here at Ops Barbecue in Burns, Tennessee. Thank you guys all for coming. It was overall win number 1003. I'll be in Pigeon Forge, Tennessee tomorrow taking on a giant Indian taco. So thank you guys for watching.